Hey guys, Wet Movie One back here again for yet another viewer mail uh, unboxing video for you guys today. I got a good amount of stuff uh, sent to my P.O. box, some other stuff that's coming from different companies and things like that. So let's start this unboxing video, shall we? Because I have this box, this box, this package, this package, and this one that's that's coming from one of the companies and stuff. So uh, I'm in the garage right now. Next to my my eBay store, so let's start opening up these packages, shall we? I don't know which one to start with here. I should have had keys read. I mean, I should have keys or something, something ready. I'm gonna wait for that big one for last. But I'm gonna open up this one right here. Uh, this is come. This one came from my PO box. Uh, it says it's coming from M H, uh, Coacher, uh, Coker right here. So let's uh, open this up and see what one of you guys uh, sent my way. Right here, it kind of feels like it's like closed, but with something hard in, in the middle. You know what I mean? So let's find out what, what, what one of you guys sent me today. Oh, maybe maybe it's not closed. Maybe it is a bunch of bubble wrap. And there is a note. There is a note on here. And it says, Brendan, enjoy these DVDs. They are two favorite. Uh, they're, they're two favorites of mine. Uh, they should be something from... There should be something from Redbubble uh, in your P.O. box too, which I think, yeah, that was that Blockbuster, uh, the Hollywood video t-shirt that I opened up in my, my previous unboxing video. Thank you very much, man. Uh, there, I don't think there was a note in that one. Uh, I've been a uh, fan of, uh, I've been a fan for a long time, and I wanted to show, show my appreciation physical media forever. Bam, MK up in this house. Uh, MK, thanks MK. Whoa, sorry, the light just went off in the garage. But let's find out. Uh, what he sent in here? Yeah, for for a second, like from the package when I was when I was like feeling it and stuff, it felt like it was like a uh, closed or something. But yeah, he, this is from the same person that sent me that Hollywood video T-shirt. That is so cool. Uh, I, I still love that shirt, man. Like I say, let's find out what's in here. Really, really greatly bubble wrapped. Really greatly bubble wrapped right here. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, you know what? I don't think I own this movie. I think I've seen it multiple times throughout the years. And that is a Shadow of the Vampire, uh, right here. This is that one with uh, what's it called, um, uh, William Defoe and uh, John Mal Malkovich. Yeah, I think I've seen this one a long time ago about like Nosferatu, uh, the vampire. This is definitely one I haven't seen in a long, long time. That is rad. That is rad. And I don't think I've ever seen that cover before. And has it ever been released on Blu-ray? Let me know, guys, down in the comments. And uh, the other one that he sent is uh, Gods and Monsters. Uh, Gods and Monsters here on Blu-ray uh, DVD. And this is another film. I know, I know, I've seen, I've, I've seen the Shadow of the Vampire before, but Gods and Monsters. I don't know if I ever did. Hey, thank you, uh, MK, uh, for the cool Hollywood video T-shirt. Because there's no note in that package, and for these cool new, uh, cool DVDs right here of stuff that I know I don't have in my personal collection. I'm gonna save this one for last because this is coming from um, a, a, a company. And uh, whenever you guys see it, if you guys are horror fans and or comedy fans, I, I, you guys are gonna flip your shit. You guys are gonna flip your shit. So, oh, this, I think yeah, this is this is another one uh, that came to my PO box right here. This one, this one totally has to be closed. This one totally has to be closed. And uh, let's see, let's see what this one could be. Oh, it is closed. It is. It looks like a T-shirt in here. Is there a note? There's like two letters in here. Open first, wet movie. And then there's one that says open second. Okay, okay. Right now, so I'm gonna open this one first with a little smiley face that says open first. Let's see what this one is. Hopefully there's like a note saying who it is, who, who this is coming from. I want to be careful because I want to rip, I don't want to rip anything else today. Okay, there's a note. A long note. Okay, here we go. Wet Movie 1, what's up, Brendan? Uh, it's your boy, uh, Ralph. Uh, what's up, Ralph? Uh, I hope you, I hope you like my, my pod, my podcast shirt. That's what, that's what's in the package, my podcast shirt. As you know, uh, I've been waiting I've been watching your videos for a long time, and we talk. Yeah, we do, we do talk sometimes on Instagram. Hit me up on Instagram. Link to my Instagram is in the description box. I try, I try to respond as, as, mo as much as I can to people. Uh, great work, bro. Uh, where people can follow me is uh, Instagram. It's Ralph underscore P-A-T-I-N-O. And uh, the same, uh, if you want to follow him on YouTube, by, this, by the same name, just not with the underscore uh, on it. It says, uh, "P.S. I will be doing a different. I, I will be doing different stuff on my channel. You rock, bro. Uh, RP, right there. Thank you, brother. Thank you, bro. I'm gonna keep this in my pocket so I can put it next to my computer, so I know I can put I can put your link there. And it says, "Open second. Open second. Should I? Should I? Sh that's not hey, sir. 
shirts. Be quiet, boy. I'm making a video over here. Okay. Because he sent me he sent me uh, two shirts, it looks like, uh, for his podcast that he has. And uh, Sarge, don't make me go over there, boy. Don't make me go over there, boy. Okay. He sent me a, t a couple t-shirts. One's a smaller one. Maybe like my uh, nephew or something uh, can wear this one. Uh, let's say here. Out of the Out of the Blue podcast. He has a uh, you know a podcast called Out of the Blue. We got a I believe a small size. Yeah, small size shirt. That's rad. I know I know someone in the house that can wear that one. And uh, we got we even got a bigger one. I don't know, so I'm still gonna open up the second one. He says open second. And we got a bigger size uh, Out of the Blue uh, podcast T-shirt. Make sure you guys check out Out of the Blue podcast if you guys are into podcasts and stuff. Definitely check it out, man. Thank you so much for the shirts. You know, I, I can always use some new stuff because people always say, Brendan, why you always wear the same stuff? <laughs> and it says, open second. So let's open this one second and see <laughs> what this is. I, I kind of I kinda like, I kind of like this. Open first. Open second. It's like a mystery. It's like a mystery. What are we unfolding here? You know what I mean? So I want to be careful. Got to be careful because I don't want to. Oh, guys. There's money in here. There's money in here. Dude, you didn't have to send anything, man. The t-shirts is cool. We got money in here, man. Um, yeah. We'll put that off to the side. Um, we got $30, man. Th 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 I'm so, this is, this is amazing. This is, this is great, man. Thank you very, very much. But there's a note right here. Let me put this down. Let's see what this, let's see what this note says. It says, here's an extra, uh, here's an extra shirt for a giveaway. Oh, so you want me to do a giveaway for the the small size the small size T-shirt? Okay, okay, I'll do a giveaway uh, to the small for a small size T-shirt. But guys, all you have to do to win that to, to win that small size T-shirt, as long as you live in the United States, uh, tell me in the comments down below what are your uh, two favorite podcasts that you guys listen to out there. If you guys do listen to podcasts and stuff, let me know down below, and I'll pick one lucky winner for the for the small size T-shirt right there. And uh, that's all the note says. That's all the note says right here. And thirty dollars and some cool, some cool T-shirts, man. Thank you very, very much, man. This is, this is, this is amazing. Because no, no one ever has to send me anything or let alone money. You know. Uh, thank you, thank you so much. Uh, Out of the blue podcast. Uh, make sure you guys check him out. I'll have a link to his uh, YouTube channel and you know all that, all that stuff down below. Out of the blue podcast. And uh, guys, let's get on to this one uh, right here. This is something I purchased. This right here is something I purchased, and um, I, I, bu I bought it from this company called Grindhouse Video. I, I, I found out about them, and uh, it was kind of like one of those late night orders. Do you know how when you're when you're up late at night, you're just messing around on the computer or on your phone, you're buying shit, and you're like, why am I buying this? You know what I mean? Like, why am I spending money? You know, kind of thing. And uh, th that's what this is. <laughs> that's what this purchase is right here. But I just had to get it when I saw it because. I haven't been really super up to date when it comes to the physical media, on, on some certain physical media stuff. And when I found out about uh, at least one of these titles uh, that's in here, that I found out about that it being on Blu-ray and it was going to go out of print soon. So I'm just like, shit, I got to get up on this one. But I, I ended up buying like four other things off that website. And uh, here they are right here. Let me put my box over here. Okay, they're nicely bubble wrapped. I like how they have the nicely bubble wrapped here because I can like reuse this bubble wrap from my eBay store. Okay, uh, well the, f the first thing I bought that made me you know just add other stuff to the cart was a movie that I always loved. I always loved watching on VHS and stuff when I was like growing up in the 90s and that is Clifford. I didn't even know this shit was on Blu-ray man and I think I, I don't even know what company exactly what company put this one out. It says MGM but Clifford on there with us Charles Grodin and uh, you know um, Martin Short and stuff, you know, it, I love this movie. If you guys have never seen Clifford, this shit's the shit. And I can't believe I didn't even know it was on Blu-ray until I saw it on that website randomly. And they shipped quickly, too. Like, I got this within, like, five days or less. But, yeah, Clifford on Blu-ray. Definitely going to be watching that one soon. And uh, this one right here, I just had to get, because I heard people talking about this movie for years. And uh, it's Herschel Gordon Lewis's final movie. He was the guy that made the Blood Feast movies and the Gore Gore Girls. You know, like, the Gore... He was, like, he was, like, the Gore God of like the 50s and 60s, like, you know, he made a lot of gory movies, but they're like over the top and goofy at the same time for the most part. And he made, this is, I believe this is his final film. And I didn't, I, I totally forgot about it. And I never, I never, I never bought it, never got it until now. And that is uh, the Uh-Oh Show. 
right here. This is like a horror gore fest film. Uh, right here, Herschel Gordon Lewis was actually one of the first uh, directors slash celebrities I ever interviewed uh, on my YouTube channel next to like Gunnar Hansen and stuff. Those are like the, the first two. Gunnar Hansen, Herschel Gordon Lewis, and Brian O'Halloran from Clerks were like the first three celebrities I ever inter interviewed uh, on my YouTube channel. But I got the Uh Oh Show uh, right here. This one looks like it could be kind of cool. It's like commentary and stuff. It's, uh, it's put out by, this one's put out by Shriek Show. This one's put out by Shriek Show. And then I got uh, Fraternity... Uh, Fraternity Vacation. I remember liking this one when it was on VHS back in the day. I'm like, oh shit, it's on Blu-ray? And I got it. It's, you know, it's just like a, a funny, wacky, you know, uh, you know, sex comedy film. Always, I always remember liking that one right there. And this one right here, uh, my friends over at DeadPit.com, uh, Wes Vance and stuff. Uh, if you guys follow them, DeadPit uh, on, uh, on YouTube, uh, DeadPit Radio on YouTube. He said this is one of his favorite movies of the 80s when he was, when he was growing up. And I don't remember if I've ever if I ever seen it before, and he was talking about it, it's going out of print soon. So I'm like, well, shit, I'll just, I'll just get it now. And if he likes it, most likely I will, hopefully. And that is the Heavenly Kid, the Heavenly Kid here on uh, on Blu-ray. This is kind of turning into like a DVD Blu-ray update right now, isn't it? But uh, yeah, this one this one could be kind of rad. I can't wait to check this one out because I'm I'm a, I'm a you know a, a big follower of uh, Dead Pit and stuff, so. This, this is, this is going to be a fun watch for sure, 80, 80s classic kind of film. And uh, I still have that package over here from the company. And this one right here is coming from um, MovieZing, MovieZing.com. This is the company that deals in uh, Burn On Demand uh, DVDs and uh, Blu-rays and stuff. Uh, I, 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 re I requested these, uh, most likely, or they sent them for me to talk about and review for you know the YouTube channel. So let's open this up and see what's in this one. Uh. Okay. Oh, all right. <laughs> Come on. Come on, Brendan. You can use your muscles. Do you have any? Do you have any, or is it just all blubber? Come on. Okay. I'm trying to figure this out right here. I'm trying to get. Ah, uh, there we go. Work for daddy. Work for daddy. We got a handful of different DVDs and blues. A couple of Blu-rays and DVDs in here. Uh, the first one up, we got um, Belushi. Which is a Showtime documentary about John Belushi, who you know from like the Blues Brothers and Saturday Night Live uh, and things like that. It's about an hour, 108 minutes. It's a one disker. And uh, I always like John Belushi, you know, John Candy and all those guys. So uh, this is a documentary about the man. They also put out one uh, recently, documentary wise, about the comedy store, which I thought was cool. And we got, is it, oh yeah, just two more. So it's mostly, mostly uh, paper in here. And. Um, we got The Twilight Zone, the complete second season, here on Blu-ray from MovieZing.com. If you guys want to get you know, a Blu-ray copy of it, because I don't know if this one's going to be out there in stores on Blu-ray. Most likely DVD, but not Blu-ray, I don't think. But uh, yeah, we got The Twilight Zone. This is the new one with Jordan Peele and stuff. And the last one in this box is uh, something that I, I think I've watched at Aaron's house before, but now it's on Blu-ray, like, you know, officially. And it's uh, The New Adventures of Pippi Longstocking. Pippi, Pippi Longstocking. Uh, here on Blu-ray, it only has a theatrical trailer on it. There's no, there's no real big special features uh, up on this one. But expect reviews uh, of those three coming up sometime soon. Now on to this package right here. I know a couple people when they see what I open from this, might, might, might flip the, might flip out. There's a couple people I know that might flip out when they see uh, <laughs> what I got from this company called Mintech Authentics. So let's open this up. Well. To unbox this special item, I am in my room. So, let's do it. There could be two items in here. There could be one item in here. But, uh, <laughs> whatever it is, I'm sure you guys will dig uh, what you see. But it's coming from this uh, autograph company called Mintech Authentics. Look at my fingers, man. Like, I got, using that pen to open up boxes, I got, like, pen marks all over my fingers. Mintech Authentics. This is an autograph company I got stuff from before. And, uh, you know, they hold, they hold private signings, like they have one right now. You can uh, get a, you know, uh, order a pre-sale for a, a, a Danny Trejo uh, autographed item, a, you know, autographed piece. A whole bunch of other people, like the guy from Slipknot, uh, Corey Taylor, they're having a private signing with him coming up soon. A whole bunch of other autographed stuff. They, they, deal, they deal a lot in horror stuff, but they dabble in regular other Hollywood stuff as well. So uh, let's open this up and see what uh, Mintech has in store 
for me and for you for this video today, right now, right now, come on. Gotta be real careful. Gotta be real careful with this. Some of you guys are gonna be like, oh shit. Oh shit, when you see this. Okay, okay. So I just wanna show you guys what kind of cool stuff you could possibly get if you go to mentechauthentics.com. Uh, I'll have a link for their uh, website. Oh my God. I have a link for their website down below. They also gave me a card uh, right here to their website. And here's like the link to their info, which I have a lot of info, you know, the website link in the description box of this video uh, right there. Mentech Authentics. <sighs> Whew. Jesus Christ. It's two things in here. Okay. First thing I got was uh, an autograph on a mini poster of a movie that I loved. And I still love to this day. And uh, sad to say, uh, I'm never, you know, I'm never going to be able to meet uh, this icon uh, in person, the, one of the, one of the people that's on the, on in this movie sadly passed away, but uh, one of the other people is still alive and kicking, and uh, that is David Spade signed Tommy Boy mini poster Beckett authenticated uh, right here. David Spade Tommy Boy Black Sheep man, how could you go wrong with those comedy films right there? You know what I'm saying? Like housekeeping, housekeeping, me fluff your pillow. Housekeeping, how you know? Come on, man, David Spade. We got the you know, there's David, you know, David Spade uh, autograph. He even inscribed his uh, character name Richard uh, on this mini poster right here. I think it's like 12 by 18, and uh, that's rad. But um, okay, some of you guys, if you're if you guys are real big horror fans, 90s, 90s horror fans, are we gonna flip? You guys are gonna flip your shit. Um, Whew. When, when you guys see this right here, oh my god. And, um, Jose, Master Chaos. Ho sit down for this. Sit down for this, Master Chaos. Um, guys, check this out. I got David Spade on a Tommy Boy, but I also got from Mentech Authentics. I'm trying to get, like, little dust on here because these, these are in, you know, um, the little protectors for the thing. I got something that's kind of insane. Kind of insane. I got a Scream. Scream mini poster uh, right here that's signed by Nev Campbell, Matthew Lillard, Skeet Ulrich, and Courtney Cox. Okay, I'll, 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 I'll let that sink in right now. I'll let that sink in right now. Nev Campbell, Skeet Ulrich, Inscribes uh, uh, Billy. Nev Campbell inscribes uh, uh, you sick fuckers. Uh, Nev Campbell, Sydney. We got Matthew Lillard inscribes Stu. And Courtney Cox. All on this mini poster of Scream right here. One of the best 90s horror movies of all time. Right here. The film that kickstarted horror in the 90s. You know what I'm saying? Come on now. What do you guys think of this right here? We got, we got, we, we got four principal cast members on this mini poster right here. So hopefully one day, sometime down the road, I can add Jamie Kennedy to it because I met Jamie Kennedy a couple times before he signed my Scream DVD. Hopefully, you know him. I'll get you know uh, Jamie Jamie Kennedy on here one day. Uh, maybe a couple of other uh, characters like Rose McGowan. I believe Rose McGowan does conventions sometimes. But dude. Four principal cast members all signed my Scream mini poster. Boom. That's how I end a video, baby. That's how I end an unboxing video uh, for you guys right here. If you guys enjoyed uh, this video, give this video a thumbs up. If you guys would ever like to send anything uh, for me to open on video, and if you guys have like a website or anything like that you would like to, you know, have a little shout out to, I can't guarantee followers are going to go to it or anything like that. But if you guys want, let you know, um, addresses down below to my P.O. box. And also make sure you guys check out Mentech uh, Authentics. I'll have their link to their website down below as well. Like I said, they hold a lot of private signings. They have a whole bunch of different stuff that you can get off their website. Uh, right now, if you guys check them out, Mentech Authentics.
I'll have a link for their website in the description box. Come on. David Spade? Screamcast? Woo! -hoo -hoo! But guys, thank you so much for, for watching and supporting my videos. Uh, thanks for everyone that sent uh, items to my P.O. box because no one ever has to do that. No one ever has to do that, but it does brighten my day, uh, you know what I'm saying, and you know, it gives me some fun videos to do for you guys that watch and things like that. I really do appreciate your love and support. Give this video a thumbs up, and check out all the links down below, and I'll catch you knuckleheads on the next time, next one. Dude, I gotta wash my hands. I got like pen marks all over my hands, man.